The Christian proverb is that man's extremity is God's opportunity. And uh, so people, in other words, have to get desperate. Imagine the idea that the moment you were born, you were kicked off the edge of a precipice and you're falling. As you fell, a great lump of rock came with you and is traveling alongside you. And you're clinging to it for dear life and thinking, gee, I've got to hold on to this, you see? Well, it doesn't do a thing for you. And you'll only, it's only making you anxious. And it's only when you understand that it doesn't do a thing for you that you let go and relax. So everybody's in this situation. We're all completely insecure. We're all headed straight for death as if we had been condemned by a judge. And yet here we are all clinging on to things. And we, we have all sorts of alibis for doing this. We say, well, I have responsibilities for my dependence and I've got to cling on. But all you're doing is you're teaching your dependents to cling in the same way as you are. And, and making them miserable by learning to go on surviving compulsively. So the thing is, same way, if you're caught in a torrent and you try to get out of it by swimming against it, you'll just wear yourself out and you're still carried along with it. So the sensible thing to do is to turn around and swim with it. And if you want to get out of it, swim towards the edge. But go with it. Same way when you're sailing. Always keep the wind in your sails. If you want to go against the wind, tack. But use the wind. So it's this way, you know, we're all in this great stream of change, which we call life. We are the stream. If you imagine you're separate from it and you're being carried along by it as if you were a cork, that's a delusion. You're a wave of the stream itself. So get with it. 